Welcome back to another episode of the action figure review. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, yeah. And hit the notification bell when I do a new video. Maybe, I don't know. Anyway, so yeah, um, I'm thinking, uh, so uh, this is going to be a video of an updated DC DVD and Blu-ray collection. The last one was like, I don't know, three months ago. So I'm going to do an updated version of it. Um, yeah, I was thinking of doing toy news, because there's a lot of new McFarlane stuff out, like there's the new Swamp Thing that already has came out, so that's not very new, but, and then there's this new Frost King Wave, and then there's a new Clayface for the DC Multiverse McFarlane toys line, so I could be doing toy news, let me know in the comments if you would like that. So let me begin, so first up. What I have uh, is the a three film collection. This is the um, Christopher Reeves. Well, this one is a different actor. Three movie collection on Blu-ray. So got all three: the original Superman movie, the original Downer cut for the second one, and then Superman Returns. And the inside, you get stuff like this. And then you got the disc on the right, which has some nice artwork on it. Next up, I have the original Batman Michael Keaton movie film from uh, 19, er, 1989, I think. So here it is. Here's the back. I This is not... Uh, I'm planning on getting some anthology set. That comes with all of them on DVD, or I'll get the 4K version set. So, here's the discs. And this, and the little special, special features. It's commentary by director Tim Burton, okay, blah, 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 on set with Bob Kane. And it does come with a lot of stuff, like music videos as well. Beyond Batman documentary gallery, so a lot of stuff. These are, even though they're older, just DVD, everyone collects like 4K Blu-ray and Steelbooks. They're still nice, let's say. Here's Batman the Animated Series Season 1 as well. As you can see, it does have some really cool artwork. Got some characters. Let's see. And then... Just have some artwork under the discs. You can see. So, that's uh, the first season of the anime series, probably the best Batman show ever. Here's season two. Awesome. On the side, you get a picture of Joker. More artwork. Same kind of artwork because it's under the discs. Let me see. I don't have season four. I do have season three, which I'll just show you in one second. A little red little finger. Okay, well, that won't be standing up anytime soon. Here's Batman Season 3. Just the same artwork inside. This season, like, introduced probably the most characters. Maybe introduced one called Baby Doll. Right there, you can see. Batman's holding her. And then a whole bunch of other characters like Scarface and the Ventriloquist. Down there. So that's nice. So yeah, I don't have season four, which uh, I'll, I'm planning on getting someday. I do have one more thing for the animated series. It's uh, my uh, this got ripped somehow. It's Batman Secrets of the Cape Crusader. These are nice, really awesome episodes. 
They have a lot of these little co collection things. It's called Secret of the Cape Crusader. They're cool little episodes. Next up, I got Superman the Animated Series Season 1 on DVD. There's a new Blu-ray set, which I might get. I don't know, maybe. Maybe not. And uh, I don't have the other seasons for Superman the Animated Series, which I hope I get sometime. Next up, I get... Wait, no, maybe. No, 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 no. Uh, it's Justice League season one. I don't have season two. I'm, I'm really upset that these are really scratched DVDs. So I might have to get like I don't know a new one. Maybe the whole show on Blu-ray or I don't know. Just get, but I won't get season two. Here's Justice League Paradise Lost. Just four episodes. See. The episodes are Paradise Island 1 and 2 and War, 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 War World Part 1 and 2. And it does have some artwork on the sides. And then the disc. Next, following the DC Animated Universe, Batman Beyond the Movie. I do have season 1, but I um, don't know where the cover is. So, yeah, this is uh, part of season one. It's just like, the movie, it's just, I don't know, two, the, the first two episodes, and then it just comes four other episodes. And the episodes that it comes with are Gotham Golden, The Winning Edge, Dead Men's Hunt, and Meltdown. So that's cool. Here's Batman Begins. Only one I have from the Dark Knight trilogy. I'm planning on getting the others someday. Someday. But, yeah, it just comes with a whole bunch of other stuff as well. Advertising for the Dark Knight, which, which I'm planning on getting someday, maybe. Next up, I have Son of Batman. Animated film. This is a pretty good film. I'm not a fan of the Damian Wayne version in, these, in this movie. But I don't. I do like the character. This is a two disc special edition. Some of these DC animated movies says it comes with a sneak peek at their next DC animated movie, which is called Assault on Arkham, which is very good. Uh, I think it's better than live action Suicide Squad. It's an animated Suicide Squad. The other one, I think, is still good. Maybe. Um, and then. It does come with two vaults, or two bonus cartoons from the DC vault. I guess that's nice. I mean, who's ever going to watch that? So, Batman vs. Robin, the, the second part of it. This is a pretty good movie. Again, with Damian Wayne. This comes with four bonus cartoons. And then this next movie is Gods and Monsters, which I think a lot of people don't like that. Here's Man of Steel. Well, I don't hate that other movie. You know. So here's Man of Steel. It's Zack Snyder's first DC movie. I have their first two, and I don't have the other ones like Suicide Squad and the, that, and then uh, Shazam, Aquaman, the second Suicide Squad, Birds of Prey. Wonder Woman 1984, and then uh, Wonder Woman. All of those, are, I think I have on, like, Voodoo or something. Which I, I, I want to get them, maybe on 4K or Voodoo or some Or on Blu-ray, or on Blu-ray, the other ones. Okay. And I told you, I did have the second film of Zack Snyder, Justice League. Or, no, this is, uh... Batman vs. Superman. Oh, yeah, and there's also Justice League Zack Snyder as well. But... This is the Ultimate Edition, which I think fixed, like, a lot of things that are, it, it fixed a lot of things that the, the other one had. No, we don't talk about that. That's just, no, not good. Okay, so, yeah, here's the discs. Blu-ray for the extended cut, and then the theatrical cut. <sighs> or maybe I got them backwards.
Teen Titans Go Season 3 Part 1. A lot of people think this show is trash. I think most of it is, but some parts are actually not terrible. Here's Young Justice. Uh, awesome show. This is Season 3 Part or Season two, 1 Part 3. Or 4. Here is the... I say to this, it's not even me, you guys. Don't I don't like it. Okay. So yeah, it was awesome. Yeah, it's not awesome actually. So here's Justice League, uh, Crisis on Tour. It's very good, awesome. And then this. Three film collection. This comes with Red Hood, Year One, and Gotham Knight. All awesome. This is awesome too. Okay, and the last one. The last part of the collection is just an animated Lego film. It's called DC Comics Clash, which comes with. It. It's not terrible. It's pretty good. Here's it. It comes with a little Lego figure, which I really do like. Here's the figure. It just has some decent printing on him and detail, but these pieces that he uses are very useful for other stuff. And then that's it. That's my updated DC Blu-ray collection. Maybe I'll do it like a more updated one um, in the future. Like I'll get like maybe 10 more items that are DC related. So yeah, see you guys later. Bye-bye.